guys, Blee Enders here, and yesterday was the third race in the NASCAR playoffs at the Charlotte Roval. So in yesterday's race, William Byron started on the pole with his teammate Alex Bowman starting alongside him in second for the running of the Bank of America Roval 400. And after William Byron started on the pole, he would go on to pull away to a pretty decent lead over the field, and then later on in this stage, the caution came out for Ryan Priest who spun out going into the backstretch chicane but was able to keep going. And then on the restart with two laps to go in this stage, the caution came out again after multiple cars collided going into the first turn, which then made the stage end under caution. And since Kyle Larson was able to pass William Byron on the restart before the caution came out, he would go on to win stage one. Then in stage two, after the pit stop between stages, Joey Logano was able to come off pit road as the leader. Then with 20 laps to go in this stage, Chase Elliott was able to pass Logano for the lead. Then a few laps later, the caution came out for Bubba Wallace who got spun out by Alex Bowman coming out of the backstretch to Kane, which then with six laps to go in this stage after pit stops gave the lead to Clint Boyer for the restart. Then in the final laps of the stage, Chase Elliott was able to make his way back up to the front and pass Boyer for the lead to go on and win stage two. So then in the third and final stage, Chase Elliott remained out front. Then later on in the stage, the caution came out for Daniel Hemrick who spun out. Then on the restart, Chase Elliott, who was the leader, went straight into the wall after his brakes locked up going into turn number one, which then gave the lead to Kevin Harvick for the restart. Then a few laps later, the caution came out for Ricky Stenhouse Jr., who spun out. Then a few laps later, the caution came out again as multiple cars wrecked in the infield part of the track. Then a little while later, the caution came out once again as Chris Buescher and Kurt Busch spun out coming out of the infield part of the track, which then turned into a red flag because there was fluid leaking onto the track. Then on the restart, with seven laps to go with Chase Elliott back out front after his incident earlier, Alex Bowman moved into second and tried to chase down his teammate, but didn't quite have enough, so Chase Elliott ended up going on to get the win at the Roval. So congrats to Chase Elliott on winning the third race in the NASCAR playoffs at the Charlotte Roval and locking himself in the next round of the playoffs. Now the drivers that didn't end up making it into the round of 12 were Eric Almirola, Ryan Newman, Kurt Busch, and Eric Jones. Also, be sure to watch the fourth race in the NASCAR playoffs at Dover International Speedway next Sunday at 2.30 p.m. Eastern Time. But anyways, that's going to be much it for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed. Like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video or later.